Good evening and welcome to Night Prayer on this warm evening of Monday the 10th of August 2020. And this evening, as we did this morning, we've been asked to remember Lawrence, who is deacon at Rome, and Martha in the year 258. So as we gather together for worship, we just take this opportunity to pause and reflect upon the day that has been. The Lord Almighty, grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. We say together, Most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us by your Spirit, and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now, and shall be for ever. Amen. Alleluia. And we say together that evening prayer, or hymn rather, before the ending of the day, creator of the world, we pray that you with steadfast love would keep your watch around us while we sleep. From evil dreams defend our sight, from fears and terrors of the night. Tread underfoot our deadly foe, that we no sinful thought may know. O Father, that we ask be done, through Jesus Christ, your only Son, and Holy Spirit, by whose breath our souls are raised to life from death. And our appointed psalm this evening is Psalm 4. In peace. I will lie down and sleep. Answer me when I call, O God of my righteousness. You set me at liberty when I was in trouble. Have mercy on me and hear my prayer. How long will you nobles dishonour my glory? How long will you love vain things and seek after falsehood? But know that the Lord has shown me his marvellous kindness. When I call upon the Lord, he will hear me. Stand in awe and sin not. Commune with your own heart upon your bed and be still. Offer the sacrifices of righteousness and put your trust in the Lord. There are many that say, who will show us any good? Lord, lift up the light of your countenance upon us. You have put gladness in my heart, more than when their corn and wine and oil increase. In peace, I will lie down and sleep. For it is you, Lord, only, who make me dwell in safety. In peace, I will lie down and sleep. Give us today, O God, a glad heart and a clear conscience, that when we come to this day's end, we may rest in peace with Christ our Lord. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be for ever. Amen. Thus said the Lord God, the Holy One of Israel, In returning and rest you shall be saved, in quietness and in trust shall be your strength. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, Lord, God of truth. I commend my spirit. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Keep me as the apple of your eye. 
hide me under the shadow of your wings. We say together, the Nunc Dimittis or Song of Simeon. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. Mine own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people, a light to reveal you to the nations, and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be for ever. Amen. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. Heavenly Father, as we come together this evening, let us pray. We pray for the day that has been, for conversations that we may have had. Lord, I lift to you all those I met this morning walking round our city. Pray particularly for our rough sleepers, for those who are asking questions, their faith. We lift them to you and giving thanks for the work of catching lights and porch light. For those who seem to be vulnerable on their own. Lord, wherever they are this evening, we pray for protection for them. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. And we continue to pray for all those known to us who are struggling in body, mind or spirit. For those who are unwell. For those who may be feeling anxious tonight or frightened. We lift them to you, O Lord. And we name on our hearts or out aloud any who has specifically asked for prayer for today. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. And Heavenly Father, we lift to you any situations or concerns that we may have. We lift them to you, O Lord. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. The Collect for today. Almighty God, who made Lawrence a loving servant of your people and a wise steward of the treasures of your church, fire us with his example to love as he loved and to walk in the way that leads to eternal life through Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord, who is alive and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and for ever. Amen. Visit this place, O Lord, we pray and drive far from it the snares of the enemy. May your holy angels dwell with us and guard us in peace, and may your blessing be always upon us. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. And we say together the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory for ever and ever. Amen. In peace, we'll lie down and sleep. For you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. Abide with us, Lord Jesus, for the night is at hand and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. 
The Lord bless us and watch over us. The Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look kindly on us and give us peace. Amen. Good to have you with us this evening for night prayer. And please do join us tomorrow morning for morning prayer at nine o'clock. Otherwise, it will be night prayer again at the revised time of six. So God bless you wherever you are. Please do keep safe and keep cool in this temperature and keep praying. Good night and bye-bye for now. Bye-bye.